With a migrant crisis engulfing Europe, a civil war in Syria, and a proliferation of terror groups in the region, Turkey finds itself as a geopolitical hotspot. So what are the key flashpoints? Turkey, Syria, and Russia. At the start of the Syrian crisis, the Turkish government initially looked to influence Syrian President Bashar al-Assad. It called on Assad to share power and advocated for a moderate, secular government. But it became clear that political reform was not going to happen. And Turkey put its weight behind the opposition. Anyone thinking of any solution to the Syrian crisis must think of a Syria without Assad. Now, Turkey finds itself at odds with Russia after it launched a military campaign in support of Assad. Turkey wants a safe zone in northern Syria along the Turkish border, saying it's the only way to create stability and curb the flow of refugees. But there are concerns that a safe zone would be challenged by Russia, as it could be used as a logistical base for opposition forces. And Russia has made it clear that it's not shy of confrontation. In recent weeks, its military has made at least two incursions into Turkish airspace. Russia says these violations were accidental, but Turkey and NATO see it as Russia essentially flexing its muscle. Turkish President Recep Tayyip Erdogan warned Russia that it's endangering their trade agreements. But Turkey isn't really in a position to cut those ties. Russia is Turkey's second largest trading partner and where it gets more than half of its natural gas. So Turkey has turned to the U.S. and its other NATO allies for support. Turkey, the U.S., and the PKK. Turkey is a key partner for U.S. policy in the Middle East, and counter-terrorism cooperation is a principal element of that partnership. And that partnership has become more complicated. Earlier this year, Turkish forces and the PKK reignited a decades-long conflict. The PKK is widely listed as a terror group, and Turkey sees it as its top national security threat. But the PKK and its affiliates in Syria have played a critical role in the battle against Islamic State, backed by the U.S. The U.S. sees Turkey as crucial in the fight against ISIS, and after months of negotiations, Turkey finally joined the U.S.-led campaign in July. But Turkish officials are not happy about the American ties with the Syrian Kurds. This terrorist organization should not be given the chance to achieve some sort of cloak of legitimacy under the guise of fighting against Islamic State in Syria. Turkey, the European Union and the migrant crisis. Many of the migrants arriving in Europe travel through Turkey and it's home to more than half of Syria's four million refugees. Turkish officials have criticized Europe for failing to grasp the magnitude of the refugee crisis until it also destabilized the EU. So far, we have spent almost $8 billion, with international contribution remaining only $417 million. In October, the EU offered Turkey nearly $3.5 billion to help stop the flow of refugees. But Turkey is also using the crisis to push its stalled bid to join the European Union and German Chancellor Angela Merkel agreed to press Brussels to start negotiations on EU criteria.